All right, so Wolf and Meta now. This is going to be... Actually, hold on. Okay, great. Okay, we can get back to it now. So, we have ourselves a Meta Knight and a Wolf. Uh, Meta Knight is a character that I think is pretty decent at edge guarding. I think uh, I was talking to S2H the other day, and he was saying that Meta Knight has some of the best edge guarding in the game, period. And against a character like Wolf, uh, it's kind of risky just like that, uh, getting hit by side B. But when you are aware of how Wolf likes to recover, because Wolf do mix it up with uh, a B and side B. But uh, when I see things like Meta Knight's back air, it's just way too good. Way too good. Oh, nice tornado. I'm starting to think that the uh, the time that was essentially wasted. <laughs> I, I'm surprised that they're actually playing this game out full. Right now, there we go. There's that back air I was talking about. And right now, I'm looking at uh, Real Sean. I think that's his name. Real Sean, uh, playing against T Mac. He is getting really aggro right now. He's just kind of going in, not really allowing Wolf to breathe that much. It was always my understanding that if you were in the lead, you kind of just want to bait out your opponent, wait for proper whiff punishes. Okay, that's the nair to the face. Pretty good uh, lead trapping opportunity right now, and uh, T Max keeping that establishment right now. T Max looking pretty good. Uh, whipping that up smash. I mean, that had some implications, but he was able to get the grab back on Real Sean. Lots of button pressing for both of these guys. There's that down tilt. Okay, and T-Mac has been establishing that uh, stage presence pretty well here. And I think that's because I see a lot of uh, a lot of whipping from Real Sean. Not to say that he's playing poorly, because uh, look at what just happened. Yeah, it's a dead wolf. Yeah, it's nice to see that besides S2H, we have some Meta Knights around here. I think this is a really good character, and I see uh, down. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We got a bit of a, a little bit of a, a mess up, but that's okay. It's a pretty even game right about now. It really all boils down to who's uh, playing the neutral a little bit better. And as far as I see from T-Mac, he's been uh, keeping himself in the center pretty well. Oh, up here in the back here, looking pretty sweet. And those disjoints are going to be a real problem for Wolf. Yeah, lots of whipping, though. That's going to be uh, a little costly for Real Sean. Oh, just keep it. Oh, woo! Okay, that high side B, making it work. Okay, down tilt. Didn't get a trip off of the down tilt. Still trying to fish for that fish or fish for that uh, trip. Still not getting a trip. I'm wondering if it's even tripping anymore. Yeah, I don't think it can. Maybe it does it at low percent. Okay, dimensional K okay, taking it out. Um, can I get the. Meta Knight wins! It's my destiny. Alright, I think that was game one. So it's just uh, me and a Coca-Cola teddy bear right now. We should be getting uh, Sedgehog in a little bit. Alright, 
right, we're back to the old matchup. Okay, and this time we're going, oh no, this is actually, uh, from what I've seen, this is a really, really good state for Meta Knight. Meta Knight is able, you see the position of these platforms? It is perfect for Meta Knight. He's able to up beat you, uh, get his up tilts or uh, his up airs, and just completely demolish you. Uh, these platforms make this, make this map work beautifully for Meta Knight. Okay, shielding. That was a good uh, block punch. It, it, it's it's so bad because the second that you are placed at the end of the stage, <laughs> you're either going to be getting ledge trapped, edge guarded, or put onto these platforms. It's just it's not pretty. It's not pretty whatsoever. Not getting the other. Okay, okay, that was a good chase. That was a really good chase. Making what he can out of this. Ooh, no, 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 no. I gotta be turning around before you get that down, uh, down smash. Who knows? That might have been in. able to kill him. Okay. Nair doing its work. I know Nair to be used as uh, something of a mix up off stage. Like, people, don't, people will typically try to DI away from Meta Knight uh, when they're off stage. But if they're doing that and they get Nair, they die. So it's just there's so many things that Meta Knight can do to edge guard you. I'm rather surprised that uh, this character isn't being represented a lot more. They probably saw two weak Twitter combos and were fed up with it and they saw that it wasn't entirely working. But a lot of those Twitter combos actually can work. Ooh, yeah, that's a yeah, yeah. Trading those stocks. Opening up the blast. Oh, clean up tilt, putting uh, T Mac in a really bad spot here. Okay. Yeah, Meta Knight's dash attack is really strong. Look at that, uh, that neutral pain. That was really good coverage. That's really good coverage. Look at it. Okay. Oh, no grab. Okay. Still a punish is a punish. A jab, we'll take it. There's that grab. Okay. Up tilt. Oh, God. That up tilt can start killing a character like Meta Knight at like 130. Okay, okay. Dimensional cave. Just using it for transportation this time around. Yeah, you gotta be careful about the way you use dimensional cave. Nice down air. Yeah, that down air is such a good out of shield option. It has a really good amount of horizontal uh, range. Big core cool. that down is putting in the work. And T Mac is in a bad spot right now. Oh, I'm never gonna see like an up tilt or something from T Mac. But hey, we'll take a we'll take a dash attack any day of the week. That move can kill you off the top, off the side. It's Wolf has so many nasty little tools he's got. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That Nair killing off the stage. And the fact that Meta Knight has so many different. Uh, I think, uh, he has like four to five jumps. Pretty strong. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. That's gonna get punished. That's definitely gonna get punished. Back throw, not quite killing, but uh, this is all advantage for Wolf nonetheless. Uh, trying to get that cheeky down smash, not quite. Uh, could have punished the dimensional cave. I think I grab. Oh, where's that back air? Ooh, he's missing for that back air. Okay, yeah, yeah, that dash attack. Not too great if you can't cross the shield with it. Even then, I mean, if you're getting your dash attack uh, shielded, you're, you're probably going to get punished for it. It has a lot of end lag on it. Playing the game, playing the neutral. Okay, back throw should take it. It does. And I see right now T-Mac is trying his best to avoid that sword. That's tough. It's not exactly easy picking for Wolf. He's got some disjoints on those claws of his, but uh, Meta Knight's got a bit bigger of a disjoint. Okay, dimensional cave. You have to do that dimensional cave in the same place. Yeah, as you can see from Wolf, he's got a lot of rage uh, pent up on him. As soon as, uh, as soon as Meta Knight makes it to around the 60s range, we're looking at kill percent. Oh, okay, okay, that jab has a lot of end lag on it. That allowed T Mac to get right back to the center of the stage and establish his own little bit of pressure. Up throw. Time to chase. Okay. 
dash attack. Ooh, nared. This is bad. Maybe some side B action. What do I need in side B? And Wolf does have a wall jump, and you can wall jump on this stage.